I don't know who else gets excited about gas stations, but it's definitely this girl. <laughs> Come on. Come here. Okay, make up your mind, dude. Just because you have a big truck. I'll let you guys fill in the rest. <laughs> I did have a Ford F-150 at one point, so there you go. You're welcome. Hopefully it's not too dark, but I'm riding out the last of the sunset. Getting a sunset cruising before it gets too dark and I gotta go pick up the kiddos. I literally have a 30 minute gap. And I could have, you know, washed the dishes, done some laundry, caught up on a couple of other things if I wanted to, but you know what? That's not as fun and these beautiful fall days aren't gonna come around as much anymore since we're gearing into the winter here up in the Midwest. So I definitely took advantage of this. But I wanted to pop on here, share a little bit more about, I guess, our family, our background. If you've been following me on Instagram for a while or maybe caught up on some of the moto vlogs that I've done earlier this spring, you know that we are a military family. And um, with the timeline frame that I'm gonna be posting this video, it's around the Veterans Day, so we have a lot of family and friends and just viewers on here, like you guys, that are veterans themselves or have family that served in the military. So I wanted to say thank you. It, I don't wanna get emotional, because that's not how I want this video to go, but. The military means a whole hell of a lot to myself, to my husband, coming from a military background himself that both his mother and his father and a lot of his generations previous to them served in the military. So it means a whole heck of a lot to us. So I wanted to make this video just to share my appreciation for you guys because it's not an easy feat and just as a military family it's not we've been through one deployment before it wasn't the most ideal because he went away for the training we found out we were pregnant so I spent my whole entire pregnancy I was actually I gave birth to our son two months early so I had a preemie baby and um, raised him for the first 10 months of his life by myself until he came back home um, he was actually deployed over in the Kuwait area for that full year. So <laughs> it's not an easy job. It's not a hard job if you lean on that family and that support system. And that's what I'm coming to find out this year because we're sort of in that same boat. I am home with the kiddos while he is serving our country. <laughs> and I won't give into too much detail from that end of it, but at least you guys know, you know, what what we are right now. <laughs> but yeah, I just really, really wanted to share a big thank you to each and every one of you who have been past military or have some kind of involvement with the military it means the absolute world to me so thank you guys for tuning in today and yeah hopefully have a good weekend and we'll see you on the next one bye guys